<laughs> Somebody really had to waste finger strength translating the interview to tell us what we already knew. <laughs> okay, let me explain. Now, if you've been following the channel, which if you haven't been, why wouldn't you? The quality is in the name itself perfection. If you've been following the channel, you would know that about a month ago, I released a documentary on Joe Lynn Cujo, a fan-made character in the fan-made manga called Pebble River. Oh, I mean Stone Ocean, which was created by Hiromu Arakawa, a then novice creator who went on with the criticisms from this fan manga to create one of the greats, perhaps one of the greatest manga of all time, Full Metal Alchemist. So, she created the character Jolin Cujo and his misadventures against one of the most well-crafted antagonists in manga and anime history, Father Pucci. Now, unfortunately, Father Pucci is non-canon due to his association with Jolin Cujo and the fan-made series Stone Ocean. But I still have to give Father Pucci his props. Anyways, imagine my surprise looking on Twitter and seeing Stone Ocean struggling, struggling to hit trending with only 5K tweets. So I click on it, and to my delight, I'm met with a lovely interview confirming, or rather deconfirming, the involvement of Joe Lynn Cujo with the official and authentic continuity. So let's read about Stone Ocean. Nothing's confirmed. Uh, but he said there is a minuscule chance, he said jokingly. He told people <laughs> Oh man, this man is <laughs> this man is funny. He told people to keep asking on social media, he said jokingly. So that the studio <laughs> So the studio can see that there's any, any real interest in Joe Lynn Cujo. <laughs> I'm sorry. This man, they even got in a little parenthesis. He said jokingly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know damn well that's not gonna happen. <laughs> okay, okay, let me get okay. Anyway, about Purple Haze feedback, and I must say, when we approached that question, his eyes lit up when I asked it. He also said that there's nothing really confirmed about uh, Purple Haze feedback yet, but he had a cool story to share about the newest. Thus spoke Rohan Kashibe OVA that was announced. There was a press conference with the Vento Aro cast and Fuegos, I'm going to say that because it's, or, or Fugos, I'm sorry, Fugos VA that was really confused that they weren't announcing Purple Haze feedback. And he said that they were totally available to do it whenever they wanted. I remember that Purple Haze feedback is really beloved in Japan, so we might see it someday. Hopefully so. He looked really happy about it when we brought that book up. Now, unfortunately, this is the, the only hit that we took in this interview because I've been waiting for this series of JoJo about Steel Ball Run. Some guy asked about it and I thought it was cool to share. Kohei said that Steel Ball Run would be really expensive to make since most of, the, most of the action are horse racing and it's really hard to animate. When asked about the CGI, he said that it would break the JoJo style of animation, so he'd rather not use it. So I think it's going to take a while after uh, Golden Wind to be animated. And I'm glad he talked about the CGI though. So that's been the interview. And man, I, I don't know why they waste these guys time asking them stuff that they already knew, but we did get some pertinent information about Steel Ball Run. Now I'm having my fingers crossed about that. And I hope I do end up seeing that new OVA with Rohan Kishibe and also Purple Haze feedback. I want to see that too. But man, they know how to make someone laugh at this, this 
Pebble River, Stone Ocean, whatever the hell they want to call it. Nobody wants this fan monk bullshit. Get that the, the hell out of here. Anyways, guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Click that notification bell. The quality of the channel is in the name itself, Perfection. And remember, keep it alpha, omega, but never beta. All you betas are busted. Guys, time patrollers, perfectionists on the omniverse, peace.